Burn Outdoors, currently outdoors, just uh, sipping a fizzy uh, Elvis juice here with Mr. You look really short there, let's just move back here. <laughs> uh, here with Mr. CLB, Camp Life Bushcraft. Hello. Hello. Uh, you may have seen where we're, uh, we're hoping to stay tonight, which is the Cave of Death behind us. Haven't actually been in there properly yet, we're just having a beer because it's really, really humid. I look a bit sweaty. I'm going to go now, come back to you when I'm a little bit drier. Goodbye. Right, I'm about to go into the cave of death. Uh, head torch is on. Beer is in hand to throw at whatever might be living in here. It's, I'll tell you what, it's literally three or four degrees cooler. Oh, cooler in here than it is out there. Well, it's not very flat, Dan. Look, it ain't flat at all. Dan said it was pretty flat up here. It, it's it's far from it. Yeah. Someone's had a fire there. Uh, possible fire. It's glass there. Definitely had a fire there. Rubbish. Spiders. God, it's freezing in here. How do people get this stuff up here? Because it's not exactly it's easy, like easily accessible. Who would bring an engine? <sighs> it's 22 degrees outside. Oh, no. <laughs> it's cold in there. Wow. It's good. It's chilly night. I'm going to stop the bugs. Yeah. Um, hmm. Do we spend the night in here or not? Well, you did the recce. You said it was flat. I said flat -ish. <laughs> I think you're fine. You could probably get away with it here yeah. if we were both together. We might need a... It's going to be a, a, a roll. In actual fact, you could do here, feet this end, yeah, that way. Slightly uphill. Yeah, you could do that here. Like this bit here. Yeah, just diagonally here where I'm standing here because you can see where it goes up the hill slightly. But it's also fairly flat. See it? Yeah. But they have to be like properly close together. Oh! I can't believe how cold it is in here. That's unbelievable. Stalactites, stalagmites. Yeah, it smells a bit musty, but it doesn't actually smell of piss or shit so far. Not yet, give me a chance. It's very flat, this piece here, there's a bit of rock here. Look. Really flat. Yeah, it's man made. Uh. I don't know actually. Maybe because that's pretty chiselled that underneath here. Yeah. And you can actually stand up under it, so. I don't know when it be oh, look at all the mosquitoes. Look. Uh, it's like being in the uh, air aid shafts are all over again. Why they they shouldn't be alive in this cold? It's not minus two in here. Maybe they are dead. Jim, Mr. CLB doing a bit of housekeeping. Wearing myself out. It's all in the way, this tree. <clears throat> it's all in the way, this tree, that this guy's obviously taken down with an axe for some reason off there. So. Dan's just lopping a few bits off and we're just dotting it about to make the area look a bit nicer. It's lucky someone brought a saw. Yeah, funny though, isn't it? <laughs> Forget yours. Yeah. 
Right, well, we've uh, chilled out a little bit. It's now 20 past six. We're just getting our asses moving a little bit with um, moving the fire pit, etc. Well, Dan's starting that now. We're going to make a, the fire pit a little bit bigger because it's a little bit too small for our liking. So um, Dan's moving all the... Uh, another bit of rubbish there, look. Um, Dan's moving all the leaves back. And... Uh, yeah, and then we're going to set up in the cave. We're not actually going to use the tents tonight. We're using um, just the our freestanding tents, just the inners originally. But I think we're just going to just going to wing it and um, camp on our mats and sleeping bags only, no bivvies or nothing. So um, it's going to be an interesting one because it's really cold in there. Actually, wow! Look at all these bugs since you've been kicking those leaves up. Yeah, it's quite buggy out here, but it is a bit windy. More rubbish here. Yeah. It is a bit windy, so um, hopefully they won't be around. But it's really cold in there, as you probably saw earlier. Um, so it's going to be a chilly night in there, I think, but all good fun. Let's wander over to the Cave of Death. Uh, noticed earlier that it's got spooky eyes and a nose. It's mouse buried in the, in the uh, fallout from whatever. But I swept it out earlier. Uh, Dan got some footage of that, so go over and head over to his channel and have a look because I'm sure you'll be able to see me sweeping out a cave with this uh, broom, homemade. But we've left it for a bit because it was so dusty, so we've let it set. Oh, I can still smell the dust. Um, let it settle for the last hour, probably. Well, I'll just pull this. Um, yeah, let it settle for the last hour. Let's just see if I can see any dust in here. Bear with. I'm trying to turn it. Oh, it is cold in here. Really cold. Yeah. But I swept all this area out here, so it's a lot cleaner, less glass. I think there's still going to be a few bits, but hopefully we won't get any punches in the middle of the night because my mat's expensive. But um, yeah, I won't bore you in here because you've seen it all earlier. There's our view out. It is a little bit musty um, and actually very cold. Put your bag out now. No, bad just, bag. Just leaving it like that. Remember it is. 
T-shirts will actually stop slipping as well. Uh, North Edge. Sundex, down booties, what else have I got in here? Beanie, buff, gloves, definitely going to need them in here because it's freezing. Uh, Decathlon helium pillow with the cover taken off. Bit of luxury. Extra pillow. Those aren't two pillows. I can actually put this under my feet. That might be a good idea. Make my feet up. I might do that. It's not be slipping off the end. There you go. Thanks very much. Goodbye. Look at that. Dan's knocked up a quick chili. Well, he pre prepared it actually on his Trangier 25, is it? I can't actually remember now. It's one of them, 25 or 27. It's the slightly bigger one, not the smaller one. And uh, underneath there, we've got some rice to go. So, looking forward to that. I think it might be wine o'clock now, Dan. Yep. Should I get it? You done your beer now? Uh, no, still got half. Half? Not half, missus. It's quite quick though, it's good luck. Yeah. I think it's the, the what do you call it, the um, oxygen? No, uh, the rocks around it. You reckon? Give a bit of glow, don't they? Not make it. Oh, what, for the, for the yeah. pretty? Yeah, so they look really pretty. Yeah, yeah. Good to try. Pushing it all your way, which is not why I'm sitting there sweating. I didn't actually want to do that, Dan. Oh, it's all right. Oh, that was a bit of a mess. You're eating yours yet? No. I wish I brought some more, actually. There was like, we had like four each at one point. That's quite a good potent stick, actually. I feel that. So manly. <laughs> Spitter. How much more wood we got? Probably enough to last till 3 a.m. Eh, hey, Dan? Mm -hmm. Very warm. Oh, very warm. Mm. That was particularly sweet, wasn't it? Yeah, that's why I didn't bring the others because I, I remember last time that they were really sweet. But, you know, perhaps could have done with one. <laughs> or two more, <laughs> like not even a mouthful. Oh, it's a bit warm, isn't it? In the nether regions, in the nether regions. Mm. Smoke on a flapjack. I like the Netherlands, mm. apart from they do stink a bit. Oh. <laughs> Especially when you're my height, because I'm my nose is at their armpit level. <laughs> You're six foot, aren't you? No, nah, five eleven. Probably about five ten now, really. I was five eleven in my in my prime prime height, prime rib. But um, yeah, five eleven. But they're huge, aren't they? Dutch blokes, especially like six three ish, six four. Mm. In the in the K 
camera's not on, I'll tell you a story. Just, <laughs> just tell me it now. Not whether the camera on. Not on. Turn it off. Oh, did you? No, you didn't. It's not on. You don't. Do you see any light? Can't tell. You're smoking anyway. Exactly. Yes, when I was in. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I worked hard on it. I'll just turn the camera off now. <laughs> anyway, thanks. That was Dan's story. Tune in tomorrow night for another episode of Dan. Dan's just giving this um, Matt some uh, CPR. Look at the little candles. Look. Oh, look. Oh. Gonna have a little fire here as well. Yes. Romantic. <laughs> or Mr. Boombastic. <laughs> Uh, it's uh, what's the time? Can you remember? Can you remember what I said a minute ago? Is it like half eleven? Half eleven, quarter to twelve, something like that. We decided to move in the cave to acclimatise ourselves to the fridge conditions. Uh, oh, you can see that. It's pretty chilly. So, um, but yes, it looks lovely, doesn't it? Uh, it looks like a little um, oasis in the. In the, in the, where are we? What county? Are we still in Surrey or are we in Hampshire here? Hampshire. Looks like a, three, two, one. Looks like a <laughs> oasis in the Hampshire hills of Insider Hill. Dick Insider. Big fucking crack up there. Oh yeah, there's loads of, there's loads of fishers going on in, uh, in this there, this there cave. This one is the one that particularly bothers me the most. This one, because uh, it's the one that would actually block our entrance off. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll be blocking your entrance off tonight. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> right, come on then, are we going to start a fire? Yeah. Mm, didn't start the fire. You're doing it now. We, we move it, we shift in, yeah. shape shift in. Yeah, I'll get my little shovel and we'll bring some coals and then... Nick. Fish, fresh, bosh. So bright. Sorry about that. Nick. Nick Coles. Nick Rivers. I used to work with a guy called Nick Coles, so anyone that ever says Coles, it has to start with Nick. Did you get it? No. Oh, fucking. Scrap that. Three, two, one. Don't scrap it. Sense of humour failure, man. <laughs> Mind your head. Yeah. I'll be minding your head later. <laughs> we have fire in our cave. In our Nick, Nick cave. Seat. You can see all the smoke. <laughs> you can actually see it on my um, my footage here. Look, it's all oh. gathering up in the top. God, it's so hilly in here. Hills have eyes. Oh, I see. Getting the best best position in the in the in the flat. Are we have we finished upstairs now? Then. Table. Have we finished upstairs now? Because I need to move on my crap. Yeah. Till yeah. so we choke to death in a minute. Yeah. Yeah, that's gonna be it. All backwards job. <sighs> It's a lot warmer in here than it was. Oh, hopefully. <coughs> <laughs> it's smoky, hopefully, it is. It's not a joke. Yeah, I don't think we should let that fire burn in too long. Put it out before, basically. Smoke can clear overnight. Mm. There's loads of cracks in here. Yeah. I wonder how long it's been here. I mean, there's no evidence of breakage. There's no rock in the bottom here. No, there's a couple in the entrance. I think that's just where people have messed about climbing on the outside. Mm. It is sandstone, so it is unstable. Just saying. It's just 
saying, sleep well. <laughs> well, you wouldn't have a long sleep with any of that fat on you, to be fair. Yeah. Especially that section above our head here that's actually got a massive fissure around it. Okay. <laughs> we'll get to sleep later. And having a fire will probably it'll, um, stop it. <laughs> having a fire will uh, reduce the moisture in the sandstone, which will then make it shrink. So anything that's in a hole like that that would naturally want to fall out, it'll just fall out. Yeah, sleep well. It's kind of cool. It's actually better looking up than it is looking around. Yeah, I find that you know whenever I'm with you. Uh, I'm not sure I like this tone. I'm not sure I like the cut of your jib. Mm. How much wine you got there? Three quarters of a bottle, I bet. Oh, oh you're doing well. Half the way, isn't it? Mm. I'm not going to finish this. I am. I might not have any gin bean though. Unless you want some. You want hot chocolate before we go? Those big tea lights are quite good for us, really. Not a bad bit of light, though. Mm. You don't have to put them. Well, I bought the massager all for later. <laughs> <laughs> A little pony. Shout out. My little pony. You've got the best seat in the house there, haven't you? Because that's got a flat. Yeah, I'm, I'm comfy. Thanks. Mm. You've got seats. Nah, I'm all right, actually. It's, it's just another. Give up my seat if it was thing. another couple of degrees difference, I'd be backward. Like, probably going that way. Yeah. Like a Roman Rome sleeping bag. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I've jacked it up at the end with my tent. Jack your body, jack your body, jack, jack your body. Alright, should we put some more luggage on then, or twigs? Yeah, why not? I'll throw it. Throw the shot. I'll snap it. You place it. Yeah. Have some. Put that on your knee, snap me. Place some. That wrist break. That's going to smoke, that one. That's green. I bet you have been that one. Yeah, I haven't picked up what it was about. I think that one might be okay. That one's definitely okay. Oh, yeah. Bless you. It's ruining my pen. Oh. Is it? You put it out now, look. It's just smoke. Wafter in town, this one, man. Or if you want turbo waft. Yeah. Check that shit out. Smoke. You can think through that all night, that's what I'm saying. Okay. I think it needs a little bit of elevation underneath the elevation. <clears throat> anyway, I'm bored now, bye. Yep. Good morning YouTube. Well, I've slept in a cave. I'm not sure I want to repeat the experience. It was fun, but dusty, smoky, tiny bit chilly, but generally I was quite warm. Yeah, there you go.
there was the abode of this evening, last evening. Yeah, interesting camp, different camp. I'm not sure I'd want to repeat the experience, certainly in this cave. It was extremely dusty, uh, very smoky because we lit the fire in the entranceway, which was a silly mistake, I think. So it took a while to get the smoke out. Um, but yeah, it was certainly different. Good morning, YouTubers. We're up, we're off. Cave is, we've left no trace, but you can't see it because it's dark. Um, that's why I'm wearing sunglasses, because it's so dark. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're off now. So thanks very much for watching. Thanks very much to Dan for inviting me on this, uh, our regular yearly weird camp. Um, last year was roundabout. Uh, we've got to now find another strange, weird place to camp next year, I suppose. But, Suggestions in the comments. Pardon? Suggestions in the comments. Yeah, yeah, good idea, actually. If you want to suggest somewhere where we can camp, um, perhaps next year, or maybe even this year, if it's, if it's a decent comment and a decent spot or a weird spot, let us know in the comments. Thank you very much. Thanks a lot, Dan. See you later. Go check Dan's channel out. Link will be in the description as usual. Thanks very much. Burn Outdoors, currently outdoors, standing outside a cave with sunglasses on. Goodbye. Bye, Dan. Bye. Uh, Mr. CLB, Camp Life Pushka. Hello. You may have seen where we're. Um... Where's it going? <laughs> Three, two, one. Dan's just kicking some leaves like, like, like a dog that's just taken a shit. Oh, cheers, mate. Fuck. You're just kicking. Oh, you. Yeah, nice. Can only apologize.